and Carrie Lake. Are I'm like, I don't care Ooh, who wins. I just want to really? see them finger blast Damn. each other, dude. Carrie Lake, They huh? would be hot lesbians. Mommy yeah. vibes, for oh, yeah. sure. Hey, Nick. Hey, Pedro. Who do you think you are? What's up, CJ? What's up, fellas? Hey, CJ. I'm back. I'm black. My sack. Your crack. Whoa. Oh. Woo. Well, I don't think it's funny. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I was trying to. Man, of course, of what course. happened to your microphone? You got hair all over it? Covered in dog hair. Yeah. Dude, that's, what is this, ASMR here, dude? Lots of dogs in here. Well, we're glad to have you back. Thanks. We are you're, glad to have you back. You're hel- hel- helping us. Yeah, after you, your uh, blackface hiatus. Right. Right. Yeah. You well, guys needed me. That's what we do. It's after one blackface, we say, you're off, the, you're off for one week. One week. One episode you have to use. <laughs> You have to. <laughs> no, dude. Remember, he does a couple open mics, and he thinks he's better than everybody else. I didn't say that. You said that. No, you told me before off air. So you stole my joke. Did I? It's not even a joke. It's the truth. All right. What's your name? Hi, guys. I'm Nick, and uh, I was supposed to kill myself last week. Um, Mark Kelly. Mark won. Kelly won. God damn. It. In fact, Arizona is a blue state. So, I, I mean, I don't know what to say. To be honest with you, I was convinced not to kill myself because I guess I'm having a daughter and I'm not supposed to talk like that or make jokes about that right, anymore. that's not funny. And if I do well, it I again, think it's funny. I will kill myself. <laughs> that's a promise to my family. I will Hitting stop. the KMS content within a minute and a half. I can't do it? Doing good. Oh, you can't do that anymore, can you? Can't do that. We've never been able to do that. Really? Do. Yeah. Come on. Well, I can't do it either or I'll be dead. <laughs> 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 Obviously, you can't do it either. Yeah. And I'm Pedro, folks, and honestly, I'm going to get lay off the politics because, I mean, I have no idea what I'm talking about. And um, sometimes I just sound dumb 90% of the time, even when not talking about politics. But All right, well, it was a tough electron. It yeah, it was. It took it out of me. Who do we have behind this sexy second camera? Oh, my God. And I'm Chris James. Follow me on Instagram at CJ Talks Funny for brand new jokes all the time. All the time. Hell yeah. Do you got one this week? That's I got, uh, no, but I did get a, a season pass to Six Flags new theme park. It's a psychiatry theme park. Nice. Yep, it's called Red Flags. Oh, oh nice. Yep, they hooked me up. I got a front of the line pass for the emotional roller coaster. All right. Yeah, but yeah. it's always broken down, so then I end up on the mood swing. Oh, oh, damn. I like how I just lean in like this every time yeah. to let you guys know it's, it's a punch a yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Hell yeah. Hell dude. yeah. I must cry this much to ride this ride. Damn. You got to feel a fucking vial of tears? <laughs> yeah. That's hilarious, dude. Yeah. It's a good fast pass, dude. Fast passes are the oh, best. Oh, yeah. For sure. Um, well, we're back here, dude. We're back. What is this? What's going on, dude? You tore everything down. Moving. It's been quite chaotic yeah. in my life. Tell me about it. Trying to get out before your old lady gets home. Before trying to leave before. <laughs> trying to leave tonight. <laughs> yeah, I don't want her to find, And I want my shit. Yeah, of course. I'll leave some of the stuff for her. And yeah, maybe, like, but, like crib, maybe. You know, after 28 weeks, like, I've just said, this is not for me. It's 28 weeks later. It's like oh, the zombie this movie. Is the new. This is worse. This is a re- it's revamp. More, it's terrible. Yeah. It's, it's a all bad, nightmare. Dude. And then it's Thanksgiving next week. I'm moving. Uh, the Edisons have a show on the 1st. We're trying to record a single to put out before then. Jeez Louise. Um, what else? I'm cooking for the baby shower this weekend. What do you make? I still work in the fucking morning every day. So run. I'm training for the turkey trot. I'm going to do 10K. Oh, yeah. The turkey trot. I mean, trot. W- what is going on, people? <laughs> I should have killed myself. <laughs> yeah, no, can no. I talk about it now? <laughs> Too late? We can never yeah, talk we're about at it. Three minutes and 45 we're seconds. That's anchor, probably dude. good, right? All right. Choke the turkey. Um, what do you? What's going on? What's going down for the baby shower? What are you making? Uh, what's? Well, I mean, it's, it's like a afternoon kind of thing. So I'm not doing anything too fancy or special. Yeah, just no, like just some mac some and snacks, cheese, doggy. potato salad. Oof. Um, what was the other thing? Oh, uh, I make these uh, really good like sliders on these Hawaiian rolls mm. that are bomb, bomb sliders. So I'm doing a bunch of those as well. Beef uh, or what? Yeah, it's beef. Okay. Kind of be, you kind of make a special sauce mm. and you toss them in there and then you bake them all in the whole Hawaiian like loaf Oof. and then you cut them after you bake it. Oh, it's bomb. cut after. Yeah. Most people cut before. Right. But since it's like ground beef and it's not patties. Ah. They're so they're like a variation of a sloppy Joe's? Not really, <clears> but yeah, I guess you could you could say that. But it's just like a ground beef slider? Kind of, yeah, exactly. That's more appropriate. You fucking idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, go right. back to I'm the sorry. politics talk, dog. I'm a yeah, fucking uncultured politics, dude. pig, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know what 
know what's funny? That's with, a lot uh, of stress on you, man. It's a lot. It's been and yeah. Then we have baby classes cool. too. Yeah, you've been working out. Always working out. Yeah, I mean you have to. I don't want to look like you. That's why you haven't <laughs> killed yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know. Is that even true anymore? I think you know what I mean. It's like what that you don't want to look like me. No, it's like oh. I work out so like I fight off the depression. It's like I take ashwagandha, I take vitamin D, I take zinc, I take one a day, I take elderberry day. It's like, are any of these things even doing anything anymore? We'll stop doing it and see if there's a difference. Let's see. The but then what if it, I, I fucking redline, dude? Well, then there's a difference. They are doing something. That's how you know. What if that's like, I'm only hanging on by a thread, though? Well, then we'll tell people that come after you. Okay, thank you. Yeah. yeah. I appreciate that. Thanks, guys. We'll be like, actually, that stuff does work. I should you know, great. Yeah. Your dad. Our buddy. Yeah. <laughs> I actually had a buddy that killed himself when yeah. he quit elder bur- elderberry and cold turkey. <laughs> you got cold turkey on the berries, yeah, dude. dude. You got to wean off. You got to wean, wean off, off elderberry, dude. That's good to know. <laughs> it's good to know. For sure. Yeah, I got stress of the baby coming out. Dude, I'm in a little, little, little stressy pied. Yeah. And I'm glad to have a lover, fiance, that helps me feel better. Good. It's nice. That's what you need. Very man. important, I know. Very, very important. For real. She just lets me get blackout drunk when I lock the door and she doesn't leave. So. <laughs> <laughs> she helps. Just try and talk you out of the closet. That's it. She just helps. herself in She there. definitely helps. She helps you to the room, to the bathroom. She does. Give me another drink. Get you another drink. Mm-hmm. Tight, tighten the rope around my throat if I, like, I finally get the courage to do it. She's like, She'll kick need... the stool out from under your feet. She will. But she, but she doesn't have the heart to. She just lets me dangle for a couple seconds. When I start really pleading that I don't want to die, she, yeah. she kind of, she, she gives out. In. Yeah, yeah she's she there for the, out for, sure. for the post commit. <laughs> yeah, 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 She's yeah. like, oh fuck, fuck! Oh. I'm not raising this kid alone. That's yeah. the only reason, or else she would let me hang for sure. Yeah, yeah. It's interesting. Committing sure. yourself to the relationship is a lot like committing suicide. You know, you immediately regret it. That's true. Yeah, I didn't even think about that. Damn. Oh, that near death um, sex. Maybe that's what it is. Ooh, the pre net. That's how I had the baby. Right. Yeah. Because she chokes you when you guys. It's the near when death. When she fucks you. <laughs> Isn't there a truth that like you don't you get hard before you die because your body like wants to reproduce right before? Is that a, is that a thing? Is that a real thing? I don't know. Um, I think you, you've been listening to Joe Rogan a little too much. Uh, there was a William S. Burroughs book where he talks about people being hanged and they get boners. And yeah. I, I think it's something to do with the blood pressure, though. I don't know. If That'd be the best way to go out. Fucking showing your slong, yeah. hanging, dangling, dude. Not you. Me? Are you kidding me? Hang on to see that. No, fucking nine inches, doggy. Got the hard hang. <laughs> nine inches of fucking about? uncircumcised skin just <laughs> well, so Nine <laughs> inches is nine inches on a ruler, dog. What the fuck are you talking about? All right, all right. Fair enough. Um, <laughs> what? Nine inches of foreskin? That's just ridiculous. Who knows? Whoa. Um, yeah. Dude, uh, but back to the election. Back to reality. The, back to the fucking electron. Is that what Donald Trump mistypoed and then hey, Twitter blew um, up? Can we stop really quick? Your camera shut off. The lock. I'm screen. sure it's still going. The okay. lock screen's probably just on. Okay. But uh, you're gonna give it a tap. I'll give it a check. Okay. I'll give it a check here right. in just a sec. But bro, we, I mean, we got so we got these Democrats lighting them up. Because, you know, he mistyped. And I'm like, are what you, are you, are you what supporting was, what did Joe he, Biden okay. and a guy that literally had a stroke and can't even have small talk with people? Then, then Who is that, Fetterman? Yeah. He can't even have small talk. And I got, well, but let's support this guy. It's just funny. Dude, Fetterman just looks like he just left the bike gang he was in. <laughs> Doesn't he? Yeah, he looks like they kicked him out because he failed the, like, you know, the entry of the test or whatever. The motorcycle driver's license <laughs> yeah. test. Yeah. Just, sorry, veteran. <laughs> like, wrong kind of slurs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Man, this guy puts a slur on everything. <laughs> this guy's it. wild. Yeah, so what did uh, DJT oh, he just had compl- a little typo? Yeah, he was just complaining about Maricopa, the way that the voting system is. So, he, you know, went back to... Was it on Twitter or was it on his like freedom thing? I don't know. But yeah, he just. I'm sure, it was on truth. Yeah, then he just said like electron instead of election. And then, so just got. It's like I, every, like on my I'm like, term like, CNN and dude. MSNBC are just <laughs> lighting him up. I'm like, really? This is what we're focusing on right now? It's just. Anything to make the other party look bad, dude. That's what I've learned. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, both sides do it. It just, it just. Of funny. course. Yeah. I don't know. It's kind of. Oh, both sides. I mean, people go heavy on Joey B, dude. They should. He's brain dead. 
<laughs> what happened? Is the camera good? What the hell, dude? I hit play. Whatever. What happened? So, so what? Mark Kelly won. Mark Kelly won. Like Masters is out. Yeah, he's out. And then Katie Abbott won. Abbott? Isn't that her name? Hobbs. Hobbs. Who's the, who's the Abbott? No, neither. Kills Carrie Lake first. Carrie Lake and, and Hobbs. Yeah. And Hobbs won. Yeah, Hobbs We blew. Won. We blew, dog. We blew a shit, dog. So. <laughs> We're the fucking blue man group, hey! dog. <laughs> dude, That's pretty yeah. sick, dude. That's so it turns dope, out bro. that um, California did come over and they changed the way. That Let me tell you something, dude. <laughs> Democrats? Pretty chill, dude. Pretty yeah, chill. Pretty chill. Pretty chill, guys. How do you, you missed the whole election episode, CJ. Do you want to share yeah. how you feel about all that? Yeah, this is how I feel. You're a bunch of cowardly fucks. Whoa. You're not Americans. Well, holy shit. How am I looking, Pedro? Uh, bad, actually. Um, I think that... <laughs> I think it's interesting. I think um, if there was no foul play, then strategically, I think that the Republicans got beat with their with their plan of, like abandoning the mail-in ballots they didn't do any ballot harvesting the way the democrats do yeah and then Ooh, yeah them dems harvest hard <laughs> <laughs> and then uh i think the abortion sorry. thing hit them pretty hard too well their whole yeah their yeah their strategy people want aborts great, dude but they they uh, want the escape route their whole plan was like to flood the polls on election day mm-hmm. and then so the Election day voting conveniently gets all muddled right. up with uh, ballot machines fucking up. And Your which, tone seems to imply that there was some sketchy behavior happening. It seems strategic to me. Mm. Mm. Interesting. You think a Scantron from 1972 was sketchy? <laughs> <laughs> Those things are solid. Yeah. yeah. I know that when I couldn't get it through three times and I just put it in the box, I know that some nice old lady counted that. Carrie Lake's been talking Why? about uh, <laughs> for the blue. And you know what's so funny too? It's like the first day, it's like okay, sixty percent of the votes mm-hmm. are counted, and then a week, a week later, it's like tonight they drop ten thousand more. It's like what yeah. the fuck is this? Dude? <laughs> what are we doing? I know. Yeah, what the fuck is this bingo at old people night? Yeah. What the fuck's going on? Tune in. <laughs> a new big drop is coming. We're like, yeah. this is sucks. And they're like, oh, don't worry, the ballots that go into box three will be counted with one Republican and one Democrat there. Yeah. How about twelve? Like, right. yeah, let's make it a jury. As though you can't like convert. You can't just yeah. convince one person <laughs> to you're just try to fucking fudge it. Like, what or is just trying this, to hide dude? it from? The guy be like, no, dude, it's yeah, it's Katie. Fucking well, like it's Katie. <laughs> third world bullshit. And like what we talked about last week too. It's like, who are the people that are then counting these votes? They're all elderly people. Yeah, like I don't trust them. Oh yeah, doing anything. Right. It's insane. The elders. The elders. Yeah. Are there any other big upsets that have kind of happened throughout? Is there good news? Um, not really. I mean, it's it's a little bit. You know, it's a purple state basically there are some you know secretary Ooh, of state is, is red and i like that it's new abe homiday and uh abe homiday abe homiday that guy has a dope ass name abe homiday abe homiday abe homiday yeah abe homiday oh and the other uh, the hit it harder abe homiday abe from the back <laughs> i think Sorry, he's CJ. superintendent of uh schools or whatever um that's yeah. a close race Fucking he's he's only creeper. down by like two thousand wait is he good or bad um, just red or blue get red <laughs> oh he's good oh he's good solid but he's still down by 2,000 votes so. that's a lot ah. when are those gonna drop that's yeah. not a lot <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. are those drop tune again? in November 5th because the news never steers us wrong either the way that they're <laughs> so entangled in all of this makes me feel even better about it yes call her Jada dog because she had an entanglement nice what's it <laughs> it, was, it was an attempt that's and they got the point across do. and it got the point across it's crazy that some states still are aren't legalizing marijuana it's Even crazy to me that like, some Whoa. states are still blue dude get the fuck out of here yeah. with that well t- i mean dude <laughs> what whether what side you're oh, on uh, think about yeah. no think about like how bad the economy is the war with ukraine gas prices jobs how bad democrats handled covid and so you would you would kind of expect some kind of quote unquote red wave or yeah. them to kind of overpower, especially in states like Arizona that was led by Republicans. Was it no? More no it wasn't. Him. Was it? Re- Mark Kelly was still in. Well, he was in office last the last term. During COVID, right? The last term, yeah. yeah. No, so, we were red before that. 
But he, I Am guess I right? he handled COVID okay then, because COVID wasn't bad in Arizona. <laughs> no, that was Ducey, dude. Governor Doug Ducey, dude. Right. He didn't oh, want to do it. He didn't want to do it. the governor is above. He's Senate. like, dude, Florida's a nice place. They ain't doing nothing. We're going to try it When out does here. he get voted in or out? Uh, is that every four years, too? Every six years? Governor? Yeah. That was just, they, that was Kerry Lake was running for governor. Oh, gotcha. So now Hobby won? Hobbs, yeah. Oh, so because Ducey couldn't run again, you're not allowed to do that. Uh, I'm not sure. I don't know what the oh, okay, so that, on that. But that who just took that position is Tune where he was before. Tune in for three retards yeah. listening, yeah. learning yeah. about politics. Hey, maybe they need to figure it out too, dude. What's so bad about that? No, it's not. I'm just saying. I'm I'm narrating. Calm so that down. Was, okay. So that that is a bad sign then. Uh, I mean, for COVID 3.0. Yeah. If anything were to happen, Ooh. she's definitely going to be on the mass duty. Yeah. Just a funny question. And she's just like a pussy, so she's going to just be pushed around for sure. She has one. Do you just, I just, I like, I, this is a weird just question, a but smash her pass. Katie where, Hobbs. where does she, Actually, what prize does she go to? <laughs> she is pretty cute. <laughs> yeah, what prize, what prize is she speaking it's at? It's just, I don't know. Yeah. It's what's just, her supermarket yeah, of choice? Yeah. Yeah. Just, <laughs> out of the blue. It's just just weird. Yeah. I'm, I'm feeling spunky. A little spontaneous. <laughs> I want to know will. where yeah, our yeah. governor chops <laughs> at. Yeah. I'm dreaming awake. <laughs> Oh, but your ears perked up when I said smash your past Katie Hobbs. Dude. True. Her and Carrie Lake are probably, I'm like, I don't care Ooh, who wins. I just want to really? see them finger blast Damn. each other, dude. Carrie Lake, They huh? would be hot lesbians. Mommy yeah. vibes, oh, for yeah. sure. Mm-hmm. For sure. Really? Can, oh, I see, yeah. can, you see, can I see a picture of her? Carrie Lake? Yeah. The the name's beautiful. No, she's one, she has like a short-ass haircut, right? She has like a spiky yeah, hair. Yeah, I wish, that, hair. I wish it was uh, longer. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's a bad haircut. What? <laughs> I said, never mind. I'm I said the D word? Yeah, I did. Sorry. Dick? Yeah, dicky hair. I said. <laughs> She's got dicky hair. Oh, that's Katie Hobbs. Yo, is there like okay. Katie Ho- mommy vibes too, dude? That yeah. silver in her hair. Yeah, that's. I've told you, like I, I, Sheesh. I when girls were doing oh. that. Uh, yeah, I know. Carrie like Carrie like gets pretty, pretty, dude. pretty freaky. I could yeah. see. Yeah. Oh, she ties you. She up. takes control. She treats that's you like true. she treats you like a fucking immigrant Democrat. coming across the border, dude. She'll <laughs> fucking lock you up, tie you up. Hit you with some whips, baby. <laughs> Come on, dude. Carrie Lake. Yeah, you're yeah. not going to dig yourself out of this one. You should have abo- escaped it. Or should have aborted it, which what? you can now do in Arizona. <laughs> Up to 15 weeks. 15? Oh, no. What is it? What are they going to rule it? I don't know. Nine months? Who knows? Yeah. Eight? 15 months 28 now. weeks? 29 <laughs> weeks? Yeah. <sighs> ah, I'm trying yeah. to find the up-to-date. It's like... Yo, find an now old picture of Carrie Lake. Any results? Give me like a nineteen nineteen. It's it's almost exactly the same. No way. She's had that hair for twenty years. Mm-hmm. Fuck off, Carrie. I'm <laughs> glad you lost. <laughs> same. <laughs> get a new barber, dude. For real. Go to where Nancy Pelosi goes. Because those blow to get that tit job. Oh, yeah. God, man. Those fucking knockers. You're on fire. Me? Yeah. I've had sex in like two no, days. No, you're fired. But, uh, <laughs> All right. No, you're fired. You're fired. Yo, homie, how are your so, show? Oh, sorry. Ahead. Chris Mays is the, uh, so it's attorney general race, not uh, superintendent public instruction. It was uh, attorney general race, Abe Hamaday. Um, Abe Hamaday. Abe Hamaday. Abe Hamaday. Losing by a th- <laughs> like a thousand, by like, you know, oh, 1100. Tight. He's catching so up. There might be a recount involved there. Um, I know that uh, Katie, um, Carrie Lake has been talking about getting lawyers on the case here. Um, about time, so lawyer up. There about may time, still be something. I saw somebody tweeting about um, <clears throat> like a demand for a, for a new election, like to re to redo the election on like December sixth. And if demands aren't met by November seventeenth, there's going to be protests and shit. Yeah, like I don't know Let's exactly do what's I going on. I would do on. it. You want to go? I'll start the capital again. I mean, even like our capital. Where is it? Downtown. Yeah, it's not that far away. I've been there. Yeah, <laughs> you guys got a copper roof. Where the copper sure. state. Oh yeah. <laughs> All right. Fun facts with dad. Fun facts with dad. You can steal that copper and sell it if nothing come, else. Yeah, if nothing else comes available. Come on, sit up in dad's <laughs> lap. Don't mind my boner. <laughs> <laughs> That's always an hour. <laughs> How's this doing? It's still good. Yeah, we're still chilling. Is it right? recording for sure? Yeah. No, it's not recording, but you look good. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um Yeah, well, politics politics, dude. Give exactly, your dog a phone, dog. Dude. Who cares? Does it really even matter? No. CJ, Does it matter in your life right now? Or anything, dude? Yeah, or what China? is this? 
Homie, who gives ho- a shit? Homie Putin just sent out two missiles to Poland. What's going? On, what's going on with this? I mean, there's no real confirmation yet on it uh, from like from the State Department brother or Russia. whoever. Yeah, from the Pentagon. But uh, our brother Putin. The uh, the scuttlebutt is that like a couple of scuttlebutt. A, cu- a couple of uh, missiles didn't make it all the way to their intended targets in Ukraine, and they fell on Poland. Did and, they blow up? And killed two people. Yeah, it did, huh? Oh, two Polish. It's just nothing. Yeah. How do you <laughs> it's kill like two 16 Polacks? Mexicans. Yeah. I don't know. I don't have a joke for it yet. But. <laughs> <laughs> um, so that they So now Poland's already, going to like a national security measures, right? Yeah. I mean, they invoked NATO Article 4, which is like a conference between nations. Oh, damn. There's possible the possibility of invoking Article 5. It's you think Article like, 5? Oh, my God. Yeah, which would essentially ignite World War Three. Oh, okay. Well, it's pretty serious. I was, yeah. actually, I was yeah. making a joke. Thanks. <laughs> so, it yeah. was an I don't think it's funny. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what? Two Polish died, and I say boots on the ground. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> there is some democracy over there. Yeah, I guess we could get it over with. It's been a long time coming. So, I don't think it's going to happen, dude. You don't think it's going to no. happen? That's so optimistic. I like that. Well, say, yeah. <laughs> CJ thinks it's definitely going to happen, and I'm like. I don't know, man. Yeah. I'm just trying to move right We're going to resolve some before... I'm just trying to put out a new song. goes down. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. It's like, what does all this really come down to? I mean, there's... Democrats. The globalists <laughs> have been talking about us being overpopulated for a long time. So eight billion! Seems like we could be... We uh, hit eight? We hit eight billion. We hit eight. You know, they could ignite a war of consent. Like, if they... Uh, they get our consent to go to war then they don't have to feel bad about it. i agree with that i think we should have put a war on consent population. too i'm tired of asking for <laughs> <laughs> yeah i know i know sorry sorry you're right no, that's right. <laughs> this is a war of information eight billion people her voice is so look, annoying can little stumbles do an eight billion no, all right not right now not right now <laughs> okay i just want to i mean that's a lot of people and you know what's crazy is it was one billion more in 12 years so now as our population grows exponentially that billion is going to be hit in what six years now well maybe not because with how many people a lot of people aren't having kids now i know but there are so many people at this point in our country yeah what not having having kids kids. yeah Yeah. neither is china neither is russia neither is all these places China's like all kinds of kids dude have you seen the iphone factory lately well they just steal them from the streets that's why they're making so many iphones now india and africa probably have probably out uh, the smelliest by... people in the world. <laughs> <laughs> I did not laugh at that. It wasn't funny. It wasn't comical. To you didn't me. think so? No, it wasn't. I, it was yeah, funny. Sorry. I don't think it's funny. No, I do not think it's funny. I agree with my man, uh, Alex sorry. Jones. Uh, so you're going to miss. <laughs> yeah. Was India and Africa? They don't stop fucking, dude. Yeah. They just keep making babies. Don't that's where till you get enough. That's where we got the other billion from. Mm-hmm. India and Africa. Yeah, mostly. Yeah. Send a couple ships over there and see what happens. <laughs> the last time ships docked on this <laughs> here. Yeah. I didn't know where I was going with right. that, dude. Sorry. All right. So I'm going to miss. All right. Fair I'm right. tired, doggy. You extended. I'm tired, too. You extended this thing two hours after after we started this two hours later. I'm a little tired, all right? Yeah, because that time's not right. What do you mean? It was an hour and a half. 4.30? Yeah. 5.30, 6.30. It's not 6.30. Two hours, dude. What time is it? It's 6.30 now. Yeah, exactly. We started half hour ago. Oh, that was disgusting, dude. How you eat pussy? Oh, it does not so good. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> oh, come on. Crack that door, homie. What are you doing to us? <laughs> Noki. What was s- that food? What did I eat What today? did you eat? Oh. What was it? Eggs and hot dog? That's it? Yeah. This is a war. I'm hungry. Hot dogs are so good. They are. Can we good. just be honest? <laughs> like it is trash food, right? It's like the processed, most compact fucking weenie that they get. That's like the only possible shape that that kind of food is able to come out as. You, you open, know what I'm saying? You open that door and it just blew that fart right in here. How is? It? Should I close it? No, you're good. Actually, it doesn't smell that bad. No, it was bad. But they are so fucking good, right? A couple a couple of fucking buns next to it, dude. Some pickles. Dude, use this end. You're like hyping hot dogs right now, bro. Yeah, dude. They're so fucking good. <laughs> They're not that good, dude. Hot dogs? 
Hot dogs are so good. Hey, you did it. I did it, guys. You're tripping, dog. No, hot dogs rule. Hot dogs are really fucking good, dude. <clears throat> All right, well. All right. What I else guess we got? CJ wasn't on the hot dog train. Hot dogs are okay. They're so good, dude. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't understand Fucking this. seventh inning at a baseball game, dude. You go get a Frank's. Fuck They're good baseball. drunk food. Huh? They're good drunk food. Yeah. What? What? You're not. He's always a, drunk. You're, <laughs> <laughs> you're not having a hot dog midday. What are you, a fucking animal? That's what I'm saying. I had it for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> you I, I work with Hispanics. Hot dogs are the dog food dude, of, hot dogs, of people food. Dude, Just hot like dogs. Hispanics. Hot dogs. They're and the scrambled dogs eggs. of humans. Yeah. Hot dogs, scrambled eggs. Yeah. So good. It's hot Classic. dog food. What do you call that in New Mexico? Because that's a that's a hot, weenies and eggs. Yeah. Weenies and huevos. Weenies and huevos. Tanchicha. See, I'm not racist. <laughs> <laughs> See, <laughs> like nobody said you were. But you're like, See? well, I have a lot of inside guilt being a white man in a fucking democratic state. Yeah. You you're a bunch of cowardly fucks. Ooh, it's hard calling you out, dude. What do you think about that? I don't think I'm a coward. I was just talking about the Democrats. Oh, and then you're right. <laughs> then I am a coward. <laughs> <laughs> well, what else? Yeah. It's really Pedro's fault for not voting. That's it really. I literally was thinking and that my the other fiance day. too. Yep. I literally was just thinking that the all other day. I was like, "This is all I know. true. My fault." Yeah. Well, did, first, did your did. wife vote? Huh? Did your wife vote? She doesn't even just know fart. what voting is. Really? Yeah. She doesn't vote. No, she did. She doesn't. She didn't. That's what it is, Doc. Some households don't believe in that. Well, then that's why we're getting run to the fucking ground and about to start <laughs> World War fucking three. No, it's not, dude. Yeah. That's all Russia. That's all Buddy Putin over there, dude. Did you guys see Biden falling asleep at, this, at the speaker stand or whatever? No, this, when was this? Like today or yesterday? It's also not surprising. Yeah, he was like reading something and he's like, I'm uh, having trouble... Reading, or well, like on the, on the podium, yeah. He's like, Oh, for real, Zabuga. that's hilarious. Do you have a video? I'm glad, gonna, <laughs> I'm glad he's gonna go for four more years, <laughs> yeah. Cam- Camilla's like, just There's no waiting, way, dude. What was the two? I, I forgot where I heard this one. It was interesting that, like, before the, all the voting happened, instead of having this message of like, go out and vote, do this, his whole message was believe the vote. So, when, no matter what happens, it, what there's no. It was like it was kind of strange that he set it up that way. Interesting. They're saying that the way that he just set up the speech, rather than like trying to get people to the voting booth and everything like that, he would just his whole message was just believe what happens. Oh yeah, because yeah, uh, after yeah. the votes came out, he's like, it's proof that America still, you know, mm-hmm. that the vote is uh, sacred or whatever. You're yeah. just like it's. I- like uh, it just fucking fl- whenever your team wins it, exactly it's this, this sacred like course, institution yeah. and yeah. then when your team loses it's completely compromised exactly. it's garbage it's a 1972 fucking system of it's voting ridiculous oh man i said it was off the politics too why are you bringing me back okay, into this what do you world? want to talk about get us off What's new with you? Uh, what's new with me? Nothing, doggy. All right, just that's fucking... politics. <laughs> <laughs> I just loaded up my bike yesterday and went on a cool. fucking nice, like, at least 20-mile bike ride. Yeah. That shit was fun. You good? You choking? I gotta go. What you need, homie? <laughs> yeah, dude, I loaded up the bike, took the little one. We went on a little bike you ride. You took it for 20 miles? Yeah, homie. That's sick. Did yeah, she sleep we went... the whole time? No. She loves it, dude. Oh, yeah? We were fucking... Uh, it's a green belt. Have you ever done the... We park at Mountain View Park? Yeah, done that with you multiple times. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we go down all the way to Fashion Square. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah, and then actually it was like perfect timing because Ray was at work. And she's like, hey, I'm on lunch break. Where are you at? And I was like, we're at Fashion Square. So we met up. Had a nice little fucking lunch with my wife and daughter. What did you eat? Uh, Barrio Queen. You had hot dogs? No, no hot dogs. Weenies, and, we- Weenies, Weenies and, and huevos. <laughs> Yo, I know the kitchen makes this. Can you just bring some out for me? And shout out Barrio Queen for being terrible. Yeah, I mean, it's not yeah. completely terrible. It's pretty terrible. I mean, depends on what you get there. It's okay. What do you get? What do I get? Yeah. The tacos. They have some good taste in tacos. They do. It's undeniable. Fuck you, Barrio Queen. Damn, dude. This guy. I'm just going to take questions, and I'm told there are going to be four questions. All right, this is Joey B, the video. He's fucking snoozing. Joey Bananas. He hit okay. the fucking 10 minutes. 
<laughs> you hit the 10 minute buzzer, dude? I always do that. I set my alarm for five and I wake up at 5.30. Really? 30 yeah. minutes? 30 minutes, doggy. Damn. I do just five minutes. Do 6.20, 25. You're a better person than me. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. True. <laughs> It's Undeniable. Not fault, it's not your fault we were born. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck, homie? <laughs> I'm a U.S. citizen, is it? Yeah, in a Democratic state. Four questioners, but I'm not going to do ten questions from each questioner. True. All right? Let's make that clear at the outset here. Is this old? No. Is it new? Yeah. All right. Um, uh, I'm having trouble reading this. Uh-uh. Reuters, uh, Natanja Bose. <laughs> you tell me you never fucking faded I'm off. I'm happy to take questions, and I'm told there are going to be four. You tell me you never just, like, dozed off. He's counting like, sheep, dude. He's <laughs> like, I'm having trouble reading this because it's numbers. He was counting sheep. Oh! <laughs> oh! Hey! hey. Oh. Coming in with some jokes. You can, can take that, now, CJ. Too, to work high. What, what does that drop? Huh? You high right now? You're showing up to work high? <laughs> no? That was Biden. Showing up to work high. Well, Biden, <sighs> better luck next time. Dude, you just need a nap sometimes. Why are you criticizing yeah, the guy? He's old. It kind of sounded like he was reading a foreign name. I think that might have been what it was. He's like from Reuters, Nat- Natanjo Mabanjo. Oh, damn. You know maybe he I mean? got like one of those. Natanjo like- Mabanjo? <laughs> <laughs> he really plays great flute. Does he? Yeah. Classic, right? He, he plays a classic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I knew that. Natanjo. And there was reports that he was uh, that he was sick, tested dude. negative for COVID. It's flu. Um, it's flu season. Dude. What kind of cuck know? tests himself for COVID at this point, dude? Fucking fag. Had that happen. Interested. <laughs> <laughs> and then he uh, and then he failed to show up to the G twenty dinner. Damn, what's that? A uh, meeting of twenty different governments. Twenty different G's. G twenty. <laughs> <Damn, laughs> There's a whole bunch of G's in that room. Dog. Uh, G three, G four, G six. Yeah. Oh, That's where's it. OG? Where's OG? Dog? <laughs> So, uh, looking strong on the na- on the international stage, boys. That was international. Look, homies. Sometimes you just need a nap. Putin yeah. knows that he's sick right now. He's sleeping on those haters. Dude. Yeah, for <laughs> <laughs> which is kind of a boss move of its own. For real, it's like I don't need this. Yeah, it's like I'm fucking tired. I'm dude. taking I'm a sleep. Yeah. yeah, man. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, that's the guy. That's our guy. That's our guy. <laughs> that's who we chose. And Putin's dead, and he's literally uh, yeah. It's uh, what's going on like with that hieroglyphic? Is that the word hologram? <laughs> hologram. You fucking idiot! I'm high, dude. What do you want from me? I haven't smoked weed in a minute. Really? Yeah. How long has it been? Last night. <laughs> <laughs> literally one minute. Maybe. I haven't smoked all day. Yeah. Let's yeah, I say, haven't. Say that next time. A minute implies that you haven't smoked. Why are you trying to fix my language, dude? Bruh. Because I know two languages. So do I. Do you see? <laughs> No cierto, güey. ¿Cómo te llamo? You're not even saying that right. ¿Qué? Es como te llamas, Holmes. Es pinche puto verga. Gargolos me mecos por favor. Better? That's way better. Thank you. Yeah. So I can talk bad to you. Yeah, just shit. do that. Okay. Then you definitely know a second language. There's also like a remedial pace for Spanish. Really, CJ? You gonna yeah. hit me with that? Right. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I hate to agree like, with him sometimes, but he's right. <laughs> he is right. Yeah, but I work with remedial Mexicans. Oh, yeah. That's what I learned from <laughs> the special ed Mac. <laughs> special ed Mac. Yeah, they're called cocineros. <laughs> this is a war of information. A war of information. Really? What was Her that? Voice what is that? Sucks, what is dude. that into? What's a war of I'm, information? I mentioned this Where's earlier. She, what's that from? But hold on. Her voice is terrible. Can you play it again, please? It's just the Southern. It's from, she's from Georgia. This is a war of information. So nasal. Oh, that. Information. I don't mind it. This is a war of information. You got it. It's, per, it's like almost per, of information. It's like there's a lot of stopping. War, like your her dad's fucking her in the ass. <laughs> it's probably between breaths. Dealing with the drama. Yeah, that's I a mean, lot of trauma. trauma. Sorry. Yeah, <laughs> her that weenie and huevos. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, true. Yeah. What is the war of information, though, you asked? Yeah, what's that from? Uh, that that was from uh, her interview with Alex Jones. Who was that? Uh, Marjorie Taylor Greene. Oh. Uh, I put a dope name. State Senator from Georgia. That's a nice name. Fuck yeah, Marjorie Taylor Greene. I've never seen you be nice to a dog before. This is crazy. Yeah, it's weird. 
How's it feel? Doesn't it feel good, dude? <laughs> Not really. It's kind of... Starts just twisting his nipples. <laughs> He's like, I don't like feeling like, joy. I don't love, like this, dude. dude. Pedro has a weird thing with emotions, as I learned over the last couple of years of podcasting. What do you him. mean? You don't have many emotions. You don't know how to like, and you don't empathize with like feelings. I do too. You don't. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Please elaborate. That uh, you don't have, you don't understand other people's emotions. You're, you're a sociopath. You're, you're a sociopath. Dude. You shut them off. You build walls. <laughs> really? You like you don't build walls. It's even worse. It's a you Hispanic You build walls thing. with windows and you look through the window. He's like. I think it has to do with machismo. Oh, yeah. Probably true. How so? Tell him who that is. Because. <laughs> <laughs> My uncle? <laughs> From the Revolutionary War? It's like the cultural. <laughs> machismo, he's out of jail? <laughs> He told them. He told Tia Maria to go fuck herself. I haven't heard that name in twelve years. Dog. Says Joe Apile. Just like Mexican music in the background. <laughs> <laughs> A tumbleweed rolls. I haven't heard that name <laughs> in twenty-five years. <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah. But why? Why yeah, machismo? What, what is it? Yeah, what because it? it's like you feel gay. I don't even know what that is. Machis- you don't know what machismo no, is? No, I've never heard of it. Hispanic either. Or you, <laughs> I don't either. <laughs> it's like mas- cultural masculinity. Toxic mm-hmm. masculinity. Uh, right. Yeah, but you don't have that either because you're a faggot too. True. See? <laughs> Some on both ends. Taking yeah, it from both you're ends. You're a Democrat. No. You're snooty and you're gay. Ooh, <laughs> and I'm wearing blue, dude. <laughs> and you have tits, dude. You're trans. I'm basically. half trans. <laughs> and you have a mullet. <laughs> I do got a mullet, dude. Damn, dude. You're a trans dyke. Damn. 224 episodes to find out I'm gay. <laughs> should, I, should I call my wife? <laughs> what do I tell her, man? What do I tell my wife? Hey, my friend just told me that I was gay. He says I'm a gay sociopath, dog. <laughs> Hola, mija. But no, I have machismo. <laughs> Hot American. Ah, oh, damn, dude. Yeah, my boy. Yo, there's my yeah, see, you. <laughs> see you later. <laughs> <coughs> damn, fool. You just made me think about like there's actually people that come out to their significant others like that. Yeah, and dude. what a fucking trip that must send them. Oh, yeah, sucks. Paul Pelosi. Holy shit. The what? Paul Pelosi. Oh, well, yeah, they pull a Paul Pelosi, dude. Yeah. <laughs> They're like, dude, that's a triple B, dude. I'm in the hospital. My boyfriend hit me in the head with a hammer. That's how he like comes out. <laughs> he breaks it. She's down. like, you, you're what? Yeah. She also likes that. She wants to control. Every, I bet she's such she like, a control freak. She doesn't care about She wants him to he be. Does, like, she, yeah. She doesn't also give that, one fuck also, about Polly, dude. She's not gonna want some like like you, dude, but machismo guy like bossing her around. She's like, I'm bossing you around. Yeah. She wants. So to she be, likes yeah, this little fucking dumb. cuck running around being dumb. She's like, she's yeah, Dommy right. Pelosi. That's my little fucking dumb idiot. Yeah. She likes a little it. fucking puppet. Yeah. I, I puppet. got no strings to hold me now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that was, but... What were we talking about, dude? My, you... co- my cousin's uncle was gay, and he came Sorry. out to his wife. <laughs> Thank you. Damn, dude. You story. have one in your family? Shit. He was gay, <laughs> and he came out... <laughs> and he came out to his wife, and she decided to start fucking the ass with a strap on just to keep the family together. See, that's a good wife. Holy shit. That's a good wife. What a fucking phenomenal woman that is, yeah. huh? That's, she turned trans for him. God damn, dude. That's love. You just start crying? I did. It was emotional. (laughs) So romantic. Oh, my God. He's gay now. He's embracing it. (laughs) See, you didn't think I could express emotion for And now she fucks him in the ass. That's so sweet. Uh, I want to feel that feeling. (laughs) (laughs) So maybe your wife will do that for you. Yeah, when I come out finally. Yeah. Two years, you think? When am I coming out? I could never look at, I mean, you've been with her for 12 years, 13 years. 14 this is something yeah, she knows <laughs> no, like, I, couldn't, I don't fucking like look at my fiance in the eye if she fucked me in the ass one time you couldn't i don't why feel not? like i could because i would feel so weirdly like i don't know why do you think that is though i don't know maybe shame, like just shame gay. yeah shame the guilt like is shame. Be a man. gay shame yeah I'm like you should be a instead man, of being dude. like open and accepting of your kinks and what you like yeah you just look i at guess it that's shame. what it is i guess i just get what the fuck is that <laughs> it's you, <laughs> dude. God damn it, dude. How is that coming both ways? Also, that's what she said. Take it, dude. I didn't know that we could uh, hear from that phone as well. It's cool. Yeah, I guess it makes sense that you would be able to. That it goes, but yeah. 
This is a just hooked bad up time to have a serious conversation, you guys. That's us. We're in the real world. Yep. Yep, for sure. <laughs> That's quite the change up. What's <laughs> up, buddy? How long have you lived at uh, your place that you live at right now? You've been there for a minute, haven't you? Yeah, a few years now. At least three years, I think. Do you usually live places for like a, a long certain amount of time? Is that kind of a long time for you? Um, it's pretty decent amount of time, I suppose. I mean, I had my house for, I think, two years. Yeah, I owned my house for two years, and then before that, I just was like a degenerate. So. Yeah. This is the longest I've lived anywhere in Arizona, three years here. Yeah. It's kind of weird. Do you, does the move to another apartment feel like a move, or do you are you still going oh, to continue does, to definitely count does. it? I'm, yeah, I would say it's like a, it's a different place, kind of, mm. just because like rooms and stuff. You wouldn't yeah. th- you don't, that wouldn't count to you. No, if I moved to a different place in the same apartment complex, I'd be like, I've lived here for. Yeah, I guess that's true. However many years, but I, I don't know. I guess just like the the way the walls are and set up, and like just certain things that I have like memories, I guess with and like yeah, I don't know. It's kind of bittersweet and weird. It's like kind of sad to me because I love this apartment, honestly. Yeah. It's just not big enough for... It's not big enough now. There's like too much shit accumulating. I feel like We're starting to feel like too cluttered too. I'm like yeah. starting to feel like just so suffocated in it, especially now that like things have moved around. But um, I am excited to like have more space in a way that like feels like it's more breathable in a way. But it is still, still kind of sad. I don't know. It's a weird feeling. Yeah, I think... Uh... I think that the move is is very it's a good symbol it's very emblematic of mm-hmm. the transition that's happening in your life too. For sure, that's the thing. It will, it'll be very helpful to get into a new place and like be setting up a place and also just like a new energy kind of you know what I mean? And it, yeah. yeah, so that will definitely be nice, but it has been a kind of a weird feeling. I think I don't know. I've been feeling emotions a lot lately. Yeah. I'm like, this is fine. What are those, dude? What's that feel like? What are those, hey, homie? Pass me the joy. <laughs> I wish try, you were doing to kill it tonight or what? I try to get rid of those, homie. Aye, aye. <laughs> <laughs> never make me feel good. No, sorry, guys. I had to take that call. We've been... Uh... I think you took that call live on the air, bro. Oh, really? Seems like it. That's cool. Nothing important. No, nah, but we've just been dealing with some family shit, so... Word. No, we listened. <laughs> we listen and we have a couple questions. A couple notes. Like, what did you yeah. say? Yeah. Can you trans translate? Sorry. Yeah, Wait. Baby. Can you listen? Can you hear it? No, I don't think so. Oh, you heard my pee. I think my I pee screen. Didn't hear, didn't hear that either. All right. Cool. You peed on the phone during a, a serious conversation with my See, mother. See, this is your problem. Right? You are a sociopath. <laughs> with your mother? Yeah. All right. That's fine. Let me pass on that. How is she? She's doing well. Good. 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 Yeah. She's doing well. She's babysitting <laughs> Izzy tomorrow. <laughs> Nice. My foot's falling asleep. Are you you like Joey oh. B over here, dude? dude <laughs> falling ass asleep, like, dude. Ass like Joey B. Oh, ass just falling crazy. asleep. Does he have a nice ass, Joey? Um, <clears throat> uh, no, I just fall, he's your ass is falling asleep. Like, can you open that for me, Donnie? I'll try my best, dude. To be honest <laughs> with you, <laughs> let's right, try to try reconnect. See how huh? if you can learn the technique. What a fucking flip, dude. And use the other. Yeah, there you go. You got to use your leverage, doggy. You're using the wrong part. There you go. Almost. Keep it in there. It's what, sometimes, sometimes things are weird for me because I'm left-handed, but I'm also like ambidextrous in weird ways where I play guitar right-handed. So sometimes I just don't know what hand is supposed to lead in certain things. It's yeah. very interesting. I do catch that on myself. I'm R-worded. Do you, I'm an idiot. <laughs> do you jerk with the right or the left? Uh, I don't jerk off because my fucking fiance is a whore. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. I don't believe as that. Of, I think she's a very nice, lovely lady. That's why she's a whore. Dude. She's a freak. Oh, I, that's as of the last like seven months. What? What about before that? Uh, before that, well, before I would stick it in your ass. Oh, okay. Yeah, but would you put left-handed. it in with the left or the right? The left hand. Okay. Left hand, and then stroker? usually some balls on the right. I had to do double, dude. Double trouble, <laughs> huh? Yeah, that's the best, dude. It's not working anymore, Holmes. The link is broken. We tried, huh? We gave it our shot, huh, Holmes? <laughs> hey, man. Literally, our, we just got a viewer in there, too, right before Ah, oh, damn so it, dude. Awesome. One viewer? Yeah, Smurfy. Smurfy? God, my cousin from L.A. <laughs> Murphy! Hey. That's Murphy. Holmes. He's like, he's actually just like, how are you doing this right now? You just got the worst phone call of your life. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> you are a mas- Masochi or whatever the fuck. He word. actually doesn't even care about that. He's just mad that you admitted you're gay. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you're the, ruining the family machismo. <laughs> <laughs> the machismo's over. How dare you, dude? You what taint, are you a fag? You taint the machismo. <laughs> you take that shit to the grave. <laughs> you don't yeah, tell. Dude. We all gay. You don't talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> you bury that shit deep, man. No, you just get it out slowly by doing small gay things with your friends. <laughs> 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 Hope my new neighbors are cool with us being racist. Just get it out. Oh, so true. Like yeah. that. So that, yeah. I hope they're racist. Me too. Maybe we can make some friends. We can add them up. E L A. Have you ever had a racist neighbor? <laughs> a racist neighbor? Um, I don't think I have. I have. Yeah, me too. I really? Think was, he, yes, I think he was Ukrainian. And what happened? He was racist to you? To uh, the He didn't like the Hispanic culture. I get oh. that. Um, he would do a lot of complaints. About what? Just like Cinco de Mayo or something? Yeah, parties. Oh, and he's like, yeah, you know our, you know our parties. Fiestas. They're having a barbecue in the front yard. Well, again. Called, they have a backyard. <laughs> <laughs> he called the cops. He would call cops. the cops. <laughs> Sorry. He'd call the cops, dude. <laughs> and uh, then they would come up to the door, noise complaint, whatever, blah, blah, blah. And then we had chickens at one point. We had this mama chicken and 10 little chicks. And then he called the, what is it, CPS? What's it for animals? APS. <laughs> animal, <laughs> animal Protective <laughs> Services. <laughs> of course, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, those fools. And then they came in and took our chickens. Because we weren't in they a... took your chickens? Yeah, they took our chickens. Damn. We weren't in a 10,000 square foot uh, lot. They stole your boils. And to have livestock in Arizona or Phoenix or the Maricopa County... You need at least uh, ten thousand square feet Damn, for yeah. chickens. Yeah, to yeah, right. your lot needs to be at least ten thousand square feet for livestock. That's why it's a certain livestock. Obviously, you can't have a fucking horse. Yeah, yeah. Pig. <laughs> CJ, it's a livestock. I know, dude. It's like, yeah. I'm gonna get a horse cock in my backyard. <laughs> 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 it's not livestock, dude. It's my boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lifestyle. Yeah, dude, it is a lifestyle. It's a lifestyle. <laughs> so yeah, we're playing fucking pony in the back, then. All right, pony in the back, pony That'd be in hot, the dude. front. That'd be hot. And then, so yeah, you just complain a lot. And then, did anything ever escalate? Uh, to no, a, no. I mean, it was it was. Did uh, you guys complain about him and his vodka parties when he just drink by himself and? When he would get drunk, it would be pretty cool. I mean, he'd just be loud in his garage. So he'd party in his garage. By himself. No, I mean, he had a couple of friends, and they'd be like being Ukrainian as they are, you know. And and we're protecting these people now. Do you think about that? We're sending the Nazis? Yeah, the Ukrainians. Yeah, well, now I know they're Nazis because he was a racist neighbor. And your racist neighbor story, CJ? Uh, My last apartment complex before this one... uh, the only person I like interacted with, I was on my way up from the parking lot, and he, uh, one of us was smoking weed, I think, or maybe both of us. And you know, I just said, "What's up?" and went and we smoked a, a joint. And like that happened once or twice. He offered me a beer. I think I offered him a joint. I think that was kind of what happened there. That was the exchange. Yeah, we were smoking and chilling, and he, like, uh, just yeah. every time that would happen, it happened, like, two or three times, and each time he would complain about the black people that lived yeah. in the apartments. And, like, uh What about know, them? What were you complaining about? It's just that they existed, basically. <laughs> Can you do an impression of them? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't know, but, yeah, it was just that, and... uh to to the point where I was just like, God damn it. Like, so you I would start avoiding him. Yeah, like yeah. he'd be like, hey, and I'd be like, nah, I got to get yeah. it. I got That's stuff. When I got to w- done. You went home in blackface one day. You're like, just to blend in. So you're not, <laughs> yeah. you're not <laughs> <even> anymore. <laughs> That's how you started doing blackface. Yeah, that was the first time. Oh. And then my and other neighbor, dude, good. he was a crackhead. Nice. Yeah. And that shit was wild. It was my Because he got... No. <laughs> <laughs> he got... um. You got the SWAT team called on. Damn. Nice. So, like, literally, my bedroom window faced, like, his entryway to his house and semi the backyard. Um, and I remember one night, just fucking lights and everything pull up. His garage is wide open because he was fucking smoking crack. 3 a.m., dude, like, doing mechanic. That's a good you know, this motherfucker's tweaking out here. Yeah. And so, um, 
Then the fucking SWAT team just pulls in. They have them in handcuffs, Damn. have them on the ground. Me, I was probably, what, 14? Why did they have SWAT for just somebody smoking? I don't know. If, I mean, he was a biker dude. Oh. I didn't know. If, I was like, at 14, I was like, I don't know if he's associated with like some fucking... HA's dude, you know, or something like that. With Fetterman. And then, uh, with Fetterman. <laughs> yeah, Fetterman out here riding bikes. With him. And uh, he had a two stroke bike, actually. I don't know what that means, but carry on. And Fetterman, Fetterman had two strokes. Yeah, it was a Fetterman, uh, Fetterman joke, dude. Okay. Come on. Sorry. Dude, my home runs, you miss them. God damn it, dude. Sorry, dude. <laughs> um, but then, like, all I can see from my bedroom window was his front door open, and then. then Inside um, his front door, there was this luggage with what looked to be like bricks of cocaine. Uh-huh. And so, or like some kind of fucking. Yeah, I've never seen this stuff. Paraphernalia, so yeah. Like, yeah. And so I was like, God damn, this guy's higher ranking in whatever organization yeah. he's in, you know, because he's fucking. <laughs> but that same time, it's like, why, if you're a higher ranking person, like, why are you fucking tweaking out at 3 a.m. Yeah, working on your bike, a dude? A bunch of narcotics doesn't mean he's high ranking or whatever. Well, yeah, maybe it was a fucking mule or something. I don't know. You'd just be a drug dealer. True. Who knows, dude? But I was 14. My imagination was yeah, running wild, funny. you know? <laughs> 14 year old's idea. Yeah. This is fucking. He was tight, though. He fixed my go kart. Yeah. He was, like, <laughs> I can fix it for you. I'll get you back to you at four in the morning. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm out till about 4 a.m. <laughs> you can bring it in four, then. Four <laughs> was that your first gay experience? Uh, 4 oh, a.m. in his garage. Damn. No, I've had plenty since then. Yeah. Or before right. that. <laughs> Most forced upon me. Yeah, I didn't have a choice. <laughs> that's, what, that's what he said, at least. <laughs> <laughs> he said it's better if I don't fight it. Can you eat pussy like that? <laughs> uh, yeah, just another wholesome episode. Dude. Any just... cool fucking neighbor stories from you, dude? Not really, dude. That was pretty chill. Sweet. Yeah. Way to fucking bump it up, dude. Sorry, dude. <laughs> I'm well off. I don't live in your poor ass. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. This was a two story, homie. We were rich. <laughs> we get drunk with our neighbors and we talk bad about our black neighbors as well. In, uh, in the neighboring were, cities. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Cheer wine. Eat cheese, salami. Ooh. Salumi. The charcuteries. Hot dogs on little toothpicks. Oh, that's fancy hot dog <laughs> eating. <laughs> You're not a disgusting animal by just oh, eating yeah. a plain dog. No, Cocktail no. weenies. Mm. Mm. That's their favorite Epstein Island. <laughs> Still out there. It's What's going on in that land, dude? FTX now. What are we at? 52. Oh, I mean, what's going on with that Epstein land? What's happening out there? I don't know. Is there a story behind that? I don't know. I'm just curious. Didn't somebody put in a bid for it? Like, I can't remember. Yo, mama. <laughs> <laughs> Good one, dude. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> She got to put a cheap. <laughs> she got a love, love, dog. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's crazy. What do you think? What would be good on that island? I don't know, man. Like tourism. Esquites. <laughs> Esquites. Barbacoa. Where is this island? Tamales. We're doing tamales either for my first time. Oh, it's tamales. Christmas. So, tamale season. I'll give you some. It's for so, your first time? Yeah, it's been Hell before. yeah. Me and my sister. You're making green or you making red? Both, dude. Hell yeah. Got to make both. What do you make your green with? I don't know yet. Cool. So it, <laughs> Epstein's Island sold for $125 million, according to Fortune.com. Yeah. Hey, 125 Yep, and the proceeds. This is where he fucked the kids. <laughs> this is where he fucked the other kids. <laughs> yeah, the real estate agent. <laughs> See, here's this is, here's the kid's of- fuck dungeon. <laughs> yeah, this, this is, this is, this is where no the bodies get disposed of. <laughs> yeah. See, this is more like a teardown project. It's really the lot that you're yeah. getting. You're going <laughs> to love the special feature. Now. And then the screen door just opens. A secret passage. <laughs> it's your beer, homie. It's a fixer-upper. It's a yeah. fixer-upper. It's not... um, yeah, that's, that's like a renovation show. How to make it yeah. not a pedophilia. Like, <laughs> yeah. Sex dr- dungeon. <laughs> I think if we tear down this sex wall, yeah. <laughs> we put a big flat screen TV right here yeah. where all this weird, you know, nail scratches are. Yeah, this is a load bearing wall. Yeah. <laughs> this is where all the uh, rich people dump their loads after they pull yeah. out of the kids. Does uh, it feel like this space is a weird Jesus energy Christ to it? it this <laughs> is there like a weird must in this room? It's very like, yeah, it's almost primal. <laughs> It's a weird pre brucescent kind of <laughs> come in the air. Pre-bubescent. <laughs> 
pink uh, panthers. Uh, sage should do the trick. We if we get some sage, sage down here, yeah. it'll be this is sage. LA. Oddly, sage won't even burn in here. <laughs> <laughs> just let it. <laughs> Jesus think, appears and just goes. Uh, not, sorry. sorry, not here. Um, the proceeds will be used by the estate to uh, for the resolution of outstanding lawsuits and regular costs of estate's operation. Who sold it, homie? That's wild. Well, I mean, Jeffrey Epstein's estate. Yeah, but how do, who determines who sells that at the end? What do you mean? I mean, he's dead. You're asking too many questions. You know what? An estate is like the legal handling of your of your assets and shit like that. After that's you what, die. Okay, that's what I'm asking. It's just like lawyers. Oh, yeah, uh, okay. No family members? It might be owned by family members. <laughs> Definitely. Oh, my family members. He's smarter than that. He would just have some lawyer. I don't know. I think he hated his family. Money. Really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Fucking kids, dude. You don't just jump into that. No, I'm having a great year, mom and dad. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, my in laws. I tell you. <laughs> pass the cut. Ca- pass the child. I mean, gravy, please. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, man. that's funny, dude. Hilarious. I'm glad we got some CP jokes in there. Oh, hell yeah, dude. We need it. Yeah, some. we were close to not getting them in there. It's just sad. It's, it needs to be done. <laughs> and do we're the brave that souls when, that need to do when it. When Jeffrey Epstein hung himself, was he hard? Mm. And how old was the kid he was thinking of? <laughs> Pedro? King Chris Curtis. <laughs> The second part of that question, I probably will not answer. Okay, fair enough. But if he was hard or not, how old is the kid that you would be thinking of? <laughs> <laughs> he was eighteen. No, maybe he was a little like he was like chubbied up, dude. Uh, chubbed? Yeah, like midway, mm. a midway chub. Do you think since like he the had battle a of midway, since he had a weird egg shaped penis? And Hitler supposedly had a micro penis. Do you think most politicians have weird penises, and that's what like, or people that are like higher in power and money, that's what know. makes them have that drive? Clinton had a hog, though. How do you know? Ask Monica. Did she say that? Yeah, she did. It's like, this, this, are you sure? Are you making this, fucking, this up or not? Because I'm taking this as facts. This fucking, hey, this fucking dude's fucking pack. CJ. What's the question? Can Did, we look at the size and uh, diameter of Bill Clinton's, Bill Clinton's dick? <laughs> sure. Uh, important politics. And, and, <laughs> and also, that might be true, but he didn't want to get into politics. Hillary did, and she oh, probably true. kind of pushed him and used him just as yeah. a puppet as well. A yeah. big cock puppet. Yeah. What did he dangle in front of him? Visits to Epstein Island? Monica Lewinsky? I don't know, dude. <laughs> Supposedly, he had like just jo- like people that are just... Being like jogging clothes, just like jog and then go to the back door of the White House. I think there was like f- some security guard or something. So there was like a, an occasion, like four or five different like a women. day. No, He's Louise, Billy, no, 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 calm no, down, no, William. No, 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 no. Certainly could be. <clears throat> he was a freak. Yeah, Willie was a freak, dude. What's wrong with that? Nothing. In the in the whole United States, the whole nation if shamed him. If your wife ain't giving you a pussy, dude, you get her somewhere they else, can. dude. And they shamed him, dude. Yeah, exactly. For and it's like, you guys are all doing the same thing. Exactly. Everybody that voted for me is cheating. Hypocrite. I know. And it's like, come on, you guys. My fellow people. My fellow Americans. <laughs> <laughs> I did not have sexual relations with that woman. Yeah. She sucked my dick because <laughs> Hillary is a fucking queer. <laughs> King Chris Curtis. Thanks to various sex scandals, we have detailed <laughs> descriptions of Bill Clinton's penis. Oh, nice. Yes. Love Say, as sexy as you can, please. Dude, sex scandals? Make it sexy when you talk about Bill Clinton's dude. According to Robert Benet. The fuck? Are you playing a game show, dude? What are you doing? I was trying According to. to. I'm reading a According fucking article. To. Where can I... <laughs> Uh, Clinton's lawyer in the Paula Jones case, in terms of size, shape, direction, whatever the devious mind wants to concoct, the president is a normal man. There are no blemishes. There are no moles. There are no growths. The independent offered a more prosaic account. His erect penis is about five inches long. Damn, Told he's you. packing, dude. <laughs> Has the <laughs> <Told you>. huge <laughs> cock. <laughs> Fucking has, packing, dog. He's got a hog. Yeah. Has the circumference of a quarter. Might have got a size queen, right? <laughs> <laughs> and heads off at an angle, presumably rather like a finger bent at the joint. Fuck Damn. yeah, Jesus dude. Christ. The circumference of a quarter? Yeah. Flaccid. That's not great. That's not great. Flaccid. I mean, it's pretty good flaccid, dude. 
You'd be surprised what a quarter could do. <laughs> Made a baby. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's, hell yeah, uh, dude. Billy, that's told C, you, dude. Billy bro. C's fucking on. Further it, proves dude. my point, dude. Every politician has this fucking bad dick. Well, this is not a bad dick, dude. I think Be real with me, dude. Billy Clinton had a good dick. What did it say? It shaped. It was upwards like a finger, like this. It was just five inches and uh, kinked. It's kinked, dude. And the size and the circumference of a quarter. I could stick ask, that in my ass, dude, with ask, no problem. Ask eighty percent so, of America, dude. Eighty yeah. percent of American women. Uh-huh. There's, there's rumors. That's the perfect size. No. Okay. The size. Well, of let's the just calm down. Eighty percent, dude. At least <laughs> that's a weenie is in huevos, dude. That's literally a weenie <laughs> dog. It's the cheapest hot dog you can dude. get from the supermarket. Weenie dogs, though. Some of them are pretty big. <laughs> <laughs> that does make me feel better, though. Vienna sausages, dude. You know, like that you've got a doesn't doesn't feel good knowing you have a bigger dick than Bill Clinton. That's pretty sick. That's pretty dope. Yeah, That's but you will enough. never in your life have as much sex as Bill Clinton. You don't, yeah, know, you don't know that. Yeah. So how does that make you feel? He's just about to blow up, dude. He's gonna have sex all the time. He's gonna become a sex. It's gonna be a real problem. Dude, he's, gonna gonna sex. Sex. he's gonna start he's getting so much pussy. He's gonna become a full on sex. Hell yeah, addict. dude. He's dope. getting these laugh bunnies, dude. These uh, these chuckle fuckers. Chuckle, chuckle fuckers. fuckers dude. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but these AIDS gates. So Bill Clinton might have herpes. Who did? Um, who had herpes? Clinton might. Uh, like, who was it? What did you say? <laughs> I mean, it's suspected, dog. Yeah. Um, let's see. While he may not have had quite the mob supplied hookers that JFK did, reading from medium.com. Oh, another man whore. Oh, yeah. Of a president. Even Gerald Ford believed Clinton was a sex addict. Well, if Gerald Ford believed it. Must be yeah, true. That's true. Good point. Gerald Ford never lied. He made that. He talk. chopped down the Jerry Tree, too. He what? Chopped down the cherry tree. Did he really? Yeah. Fucking so terrible. Paula Jones is one of the alleged accusers there um, who accused Clinton. Paula of Jones sounds like a getting liar. Her. And she's, she, it's, it's from her that uh, that we get the five inches long with the circumference of a quarter and it heads off in an angle description. Damn. I'll tell you exactly what that is, dude. This is Paula Jones being angry yeah. that Bill Clinton didn't fuck her. Lewinsky. And, and she turns around and she's he like, came he's and got she a small <laughs> dick then. Yeah. Monica Lewinsky and Clinton's doctor disputed the detail about the curve. Oh. Ooh. But not the size. But not oh, the size. Oh, damn Monica. Monica. Former Miss Arkansas. That nose be in that pelvic area, that's oh, for sure. Yeah. Former Miss uh, Arkansas Sally Miller said Clinton's manhood performed well, but it was a little boy penis that just never quite grew up. Oh, Ow. man. Damn, dude. That makes that's me want to knock the Twin dude. Towers. <laughs> <laughs> Though this she, is pre nine eleven. I know. did add pre come nine eleven, dude. <laughs> <laughs> that he was multifaceted in bed, which made up for his diminu- oh. diminutive. Oh, so dick. homie that does hurts. Diminutive dick. Yeah, Damn. that hurts. Sorry, that yeah. hurt. that sorry, hurts Billy. Me. But um, yeah, dude. Billy knew the waters he was swimming in. Tommy. Yeah, Billy knew the True. waters. True. That canoe. He knew how to rock it. Yeah. Damn. So yeah, his, his cock sucked. <laughs> Lame yeah, cock, Billy. So I'm pretty sure all of our presidents had tiny cocks. Dude. Except nice. Obama. Well, he could have been, a, he was basically white. Him, mm, I'm him, sorry, he's folks. Definitely not basically <laughs> white. His wife had the tiny cock. <laughs> oh, that's what, that's what it was. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Michael. <laughs> he would probably like that, dude. I, I don't believe that. that. I, my, my friends here might. You don't I, think that? Well, I don't think it's funny. I think. Uh, <laughs> Honestly, do you think that Michelle Obama's a cock? No. Okay. She got Have you ever seen the years video? Ago. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because it took two terms for fucking Obama to fucking make gay marriage legal. True. So he was still in doubt. He was having his doubts. I always loved I probably made the joke, but it would how he had to wait. For a while to legalize marijuana in certain places because it'd be funny just for the first black president to be like, "We's legal." Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, first two months of presidency. <laughs> yeah. Yo, spark it up, bro. She's legal. It is funny to think about how different things are since then. I know, like things were so conservative back then that even Obama couldn't just legalize weed without it is crazy yeah. blowing his reelection chances. Yeah. That's wild. What's happening? Well, his TikTok kids are voting, dude. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Was that an unopened beer right there? Yeah, you want it? Yeah. No, dude. Have you broken sobriety? 
Uh, yeah, I've been drinking. You have? Not a lot. That's why I'm so sad. I've drank a couple of times. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think it's triggered a depression. Damn. Because Bottoms I've been up, hella brother. depressed Here, homie, lately, give me the beer. Dude. Oh, actually, I have my... Uh, yeah, homie, give me the beer. I mean, I'm handing my, my fucking hands extended right now. Be I, nice to him, dude. What's your problem, Pedro? Guy, dude. Opening your beer. Do you have this kind of temper with your daughter? How do you control this side of you? There's no control in it. Okay. I'm a man. I'm an animal. He's got so much machismo, dude. It's a machismo, I'm dude. here to tell you shaking baby syndrome isn't true because I was shaking <laughs> that baby like a goddamn maraca. This gay machismo at this fucking <laughs> finest, dude. Hell yeah, dude. Gays have the extra machismo, don't they? Like, what's manlier than fucking a fucking dude? Fucking a dude, yeah. Sucking a dude? Multiple? That's not manlier. Get Fucking all two the dudes, power. Yeah. <laughs> get, all the, get all the energies. <laughs> get all. It's good for my face. Yeah. Uh, too gay? Too gay? No, it's fine. No, you're I'll pretty di- good at that. I'll dial it back. Sorry. <laughs> you know what they say, true color. It was just weird when you said that you started pinching your nipples. Yeah. Saying, huh, yeah. Too. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you got that Epstein half chub, dude. Oh, oh so do I. Honestly, I do after you doing both those impressions as well. Hell yeah. Yeah. But there's nothing right home about this. Ain't no Bill Clinton, I'll tell you that. <laughs> Bill Quarter, I like to call him. <laughs> Bill Quarter <laughs> Dick. Uh, <sighs> yeah, so it is interesting that at the same time as uh, Biden can't fucking read, that then suddenly some uh, missiles fall on Poland. Mm-hmm. And at the same time, all that's happening. But that's an accident. Ticketmaster goes down, mean for them and people land. can't buy their Taylor Swift tickets. And Bill Clinton has a small penis. And Bill Clinton has a small oh, penis, shit. dude. It's all connected. Got all this, yeah. Taylor, that's Taylor Swift's new song. <laughs> <laughs> it's to, it's a metaphor where she's talking about how small Bill yeah. Clinton's penis is. True. Which is disappointing. Kind of is, because he ruled. He the did. best president. Clinton? Clinton was a good one, dude. We missed out. Substantiate this claim. We didn't. We didn't take advantage of it. We wanted him out sooner than he was in. You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah, dude. So did his victims. Yeah. Whoa, true. <laughs> and I'm one of them. Rest in peace, too. To all those people <laughs> yeah. that he killed. That the Clintons killed. Oh, shit. Rest in peace. What? What do the Clintons come after us, dude? They might do good. And I'll be at, if I die in the turkey trot next week, <laughs> which I will be at, FBI or weird, you know, shooter guy yeah, or something yeah, like that. Yeah. That, that was killed. That'll be another... Yeah. Uh, Backpack bomb, like the Boston Marathon. Oh, shit. The dude. rice. Yeah, the rice yeah. bomber. Yeah. yeah. You know how they have the turkey at the end of that race? I fucking white They just bowl. fucking blow the turkey up. Yeah, My fiance will walk over like, like dude, they got rice here? I'm like, no. Oh. <laughs> just like a cartoon <laughs> stick of dynamite. with the <laughs> In the shit. turkey? Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah, dude. Yeah. Hell yeah, dude. So. That's dope. Are you guys doing anything for Thanksgiving? Nah. Being thankful. Plans? Nah, man. We're just. We're laying low this year, you know. Mm-hmm. Not really celebrating. It's kind of like a colonizer type of holiday. Holiday. So yeah. we don't try. We try not to partake on that. No, we're, we're blue state. So I mean, yeah. we're trying to you know fall into line and and comply and obey and be sheep. We're yeah. putting uh, black squares over all of our windows. Oh, you are. Yeah. That's smart. Yeah, that's smart. I've heard that. Yeah, you saw that. That's on TikTok? helpful too. It's. That's you saw that on TikTok, it right? It's a TikTok trend. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It saves yeah. lives. We're black squaring. So black squaring up. Yeah. Yeah, hashtag. We have to, I feel like. Yeah, for sure. We have nothing to be thankful for. Of course not. Look yeah. at the world where we're I'm just going to put are. a picture of Urkel up because he was a black square. That's true. <laughs> true. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> I dig it. No, man, of course. We're eating turkey. We're fucking having oh. pozole. We're tamales. Everything, no? Whoa. We're thankful. Who's pozole? You thankful. pass it on your aunt? <laughs> Yeah, are you gonna fucking dare you, dude? Are you guys gonna have your white family come over and like reenact the reenact the first dinner? You know, it's weird. These past five years, they have been bringing some blankets over. True, huh? Kind of sketch. Both, but they're comfy. Parents dude. got COVID too. They're comfy though. I'll tell you what, <laughs> <laughs> it's worth being sick for a little bit and yeah. then just getting better. You can just cuddle. <laughs> Hell yeah. Nah, man, yeah, we're fucking doing the traditional. So my, actually, we're probably not because my parents are going to uh, California for Thanksgiving. Mine too. For real? Yes. I mean, we got family down there, do you? Yeah, my sister. If she's in a family anymore, do you know what I'm talking about? She's changed her last name. Trader. Right. (laughs) 
Yeah, it's not she very. got married and had kids. <laughs> Traitor. <laughs> Conservative. You're out. You're out. That's not very liberal. This was gentle. your choice. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. And Jen kept Chento, huh? Well, she just doesn't change it. She's, she's just lazy. <laughs> she's a true lib, dude. She is a total. Yeah. She's libbed out. Femme. Femme. Femme, too. Femme, lib. Femme lib. Yeah. The worst. They are the worst. And isn't it just convenient how they marry a dumb Republican? <laughs> Always. With a huge cock? It's, it's so hypocritical. <laughs> it's so hypocritical, dude. It's crazy. I bet you on average the Republican cocks are probably bigger than the Democrat cocks. Probably. Do you think so? Yeah, because I think it's a different thing that motivates Ooh. those two different personality types. Ooh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> are you licking your lips? <laughs> <laughs> My tummy's rumbling. I don't know if you heard it, but... I am hungry. <laughs> DJT had that BDE, baby. <laughs> oh, yeah. Isn't it crazy that during his debates, like, it, that was literally a point of contention? Uh, that was crazy. And just, like, hey, they're just literally mocking what, his, each other. His BDE? Yeah, that was, He's like, I assure you, there's no problem. Look at my hands. And he tries to spread them as wide as he possibly can <laughs> and shit. They're like, the fly on Mike Pence's head. It's crazy. <laughs> yeah. Don't even talk about anything else. <laughs> yeah. That shit was wild. That was, yeah. a hollow, Halloween that was a Halloween costume. That was a good costume. That was a good costume. But it is yeah. funny. Like we're <laughs> we are so like our attention span is so oh, shot. Yeah, yeah nobody like heard. Completely just playing like this improv dumb game in front of us, and we're just like, okay. Yeah, I did think it was interesting that Katie Hobbs. Uh, just to get back on that point really quick, she didn't. She pulled the total. So I mean, it was really two impersonators. Carrie Lake was like a legit Donald Trump impersonator. Right. She was. She used all of his tactics. Mm, she started course. speaking like yeah. him. You yeah. know, and she got better and better at it. Has a nice dumper. Yeah. Oh, for sure. <laughs> yeah, huge cock. <laughs> There's no problem. <laughs> Same cock. Yeah, and, Melena loves it. And Katie Hobbs, she refused to debate. She basically just like slept in her basement the entire. Oh, she pulled a Joey time. B. She pulled a Joey B. She Damn, that's crazy. That is crazy. That's what's so shitty. Like, why are these these people shouldn't be winning? Yeah, it's wild. Like they can't even. They don't even talk. Neither anymore. Yeah. Just like, I'll be better if I don't still say anything. That goes to like, prove whoa. that it was the media who got Donald Trump elected. This is the point I wanted to come to. Mm. That's not the I'm point about I to want come to come to this to. point. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I just I think that's interesting because you're like, oh, okay, so if you ignore these bombacious, you know, bombacious um, bombshell, you know, if you ignore these fucking Trumpians, all, like they can't succeed. Mm. So whose fault was it that Trump really won? Gotcha. It, it just goes to prove that point that the media fucking got you right. Elected, dude, yeah, dude and true. DJT has some connections in the media. I don't know if you know who my man is, but he's got some connections in the media. So did Carrie Lake. She was a newscaster yeah. for yeah. Local, out though. here forever. It's more it's, it's a local election. Well, I know, but I'm saying like. <laughs> I'm, it wasn't nationwide like Donald J. Trump's. And you're wearing blue. I said that earlier, dude. Where were you? Oh, really? Yeah. It's not convenient. You're wearing blue, too, you faggot. Okay. <laughs> you know, I've had enough of both of you. Guys. I've had enough of both of you, too. Why don't we just cap this up and say we're thankful for everything? Okay. Happy Thanksgiving to those out there. Let's celebrate it because I mean, not everybody does. Yeah. Are we going to roast Thanksgiving again next week? Oh, that'd be fun, dude. Should we? Tradition? We can try. It's a traditional type of holiday. It is. I'm definitely going to take some of those jokes that we did last year. Onto the stage. I'm going to do all my same ones again. You can have all mine. <laughs> if there were any good. I, don't, I can't remember what I wrote. I, th- I think yours were all aimed at Jen. Yeah, it was hurtful. Were they? Yeah. I'm so happy for that. That's me. <laughs> <laughs> Amor y paz. We'll catch you next week, folks. You're a bunch of cowardly fucks. You're not Americans. <laughs>